Hi, Daniel. Hi, Doris. Hi, Domingo. Hi, no teacher. teacher. How are you? Hi, teacher. Nice, nice. Excellent. That's good. All right. Very nice. Nice to see you guys. Hi, Johnny. Hi, teacher. How are you? I don't hear you. You don't hear me? No. For one second. Ah, okay. But now you can hear me okay? Yes. Okay. <laughs> All right. How was rain yesterday, guys? Llovió mucho por sus casas, no. Anoche. Sí, tengo goteras. Yes. <laughs> oh no, Doris, me too. <laughs> Tienen tiempo todavía para reparar. Sí, yo creo que ayer fue así como un aviso, Doris. <laughs> sí. Yes. Y hay que ponernos a hacer algo ahorita. Diríamos gotera, peeling. No. <laughs> ¿Cómo diríamos goteras? En um, inglés. Ay, no sé, es que goteras allá no hay, no, I'm kidding. <risa> oh, no, no sé, ya lo voy a averiguar, Don, ya me poncho. Sí, 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 no, hay, debe, debe es, haber. es que gota es drop. Ajá, uh, drop. drop. Drop of water. Ya, yeah, pero, pero esa es gota, ¿verdad? Permítanme, sí, déjame sí. un segundito, ya se la voy a averiguar, Don, ya me dio curiosidad. <risa> Sí, serían dropitas, gotitas. Drop. <laughs> dropitas, yeah, I know, that's cute. <laughs> All right. Um, water leak, pero es que water leak es como cuando usted tiene el chorro y hay fuga. Ajá, goteo, ajá. Ah, ese es fuga. Hmm, no sé, voy a poder dormir, Dori, qué barbaridad. <laughs> All right, very good. Hi, Walter. Hi, Jorge, Trini. Gabi, Debbie, and Vanessa. How's everybody today? Good evening. Hi, Good teacher. Evening. Hi. All right, let's see. So, Walter, how was your day today? In traffic, uh, better than yesterday. Oh, okay. That's good. And it's raining right now. It's raining. Really? Where do you live, Walter? In San Salvador, but I'm from Chilatenango. Only pass here two or three days in the, in the week. Oh, okay. So, but right now you are in Chalate, or right now you're in San Salvador? San Salvador. Okay, all right. Oh, okay. Hmm. Interesting. Very good. Hi, Julio. Hello, teacher. Hello. How are you, Julio? What? How are you today? More or less. Why? Why, Julio? You're supposed to be happy. <laughs> um, uh, no sé cómo explicar, este, estoy triste, me pasó un accidente a mi hijo. Uy, no, en serio, Julio, lo siento. Sí, es muy grave y estoy pensando seriamente hablar con usted, algo personal, no sé cómo hacer. Este, necesito abandonar la clase porque es algo muy serio. Ok. Y no sé cómo hacer. Ok. Vaya, Julio, de hecho, conmigo directamente, o sea, obviamente usted me puede contar, ¿verdad? Pero en ese caso, eh, tendríamos que comunicarnos con los compañeros de administrativo de la academia. Sí. Y exponerle a usted su situación, ¿verdad? Ok. ¿Verdad? Para que ellos le puedan apoyar ahí y ver de qué manera se solventa. Sí, está bien. Entonces, a los números que están allí, ¿verdad? Exacto, sí, sí, sí. De hecho, eh, es más que todo con Jimmy que se tendría que comunicar, ¿verdad? Pero ahí él, él yo creo que él ha escrito un par de veces en el grupo, en el chat de WhatsApp. 
para que usted se contacte mañana con él o habla a la academia, ¿verdad? Y pide hablar con él. Uh -huh. Sí, este, le rogaría, profe, que voy a estar escuchando la clase, pero estoy muy mal, triste. El último dictamen médico dicen de mi hijo que queda paralítico, mi hijo. Ay, Julio. Sí, es muy lamentable. Así que voy a estar escuchando la clase. Sí, sí, tranquilo, Julio, sí, tranquilo. Eh, si gusta, igual eh, puede apagar la cámara, Julio. Okay. Yo sé que ahí está usted, está no bien. se preocupe. Uh -huh. Ok. Thank you. Uf, all right. Um, yeah, there are like sometimes there are very difficult situations. All right. Um, yeah. De hecho, right now I'm also in the hospital with my son too. All right. So it's, yeah, so it's a little bit complicated for me too, but I'm here. All right. ¿Se acuerdan hace dos días que les dije tengo una emergencia? All right. Yeah. So, okay. Entonces, a raíz de eso, I'm in the hospital right now. <laughs> so, it's, it's a little bit difficult sometimes with the family and everything. So, ánimo, Julio, ¿verdad? Y hay que pedirle a Diosito siempre. All right. Yes. Thank you. Yes. Very nice. Aquí estamos. Para apoyarle. Oye. All right, very good, guys. Um, well, okay, so we're going to continue with the class. Yesterday, we were talking about adjectives, pero no eran normales, ¿verdad? Los adjetivos que veíamos ayer no eran normales en el sentido que le agregamos algo más. We were talking about comparative adjectives yesterday, all right? And we have, lo vamos a decir así, we have two kinds of adjectives, the short adjectives and the long adjectives, okay? But when we compare adjectives, um, we need to change or we need to add something. A ver, a ver quién se acuerda. Vamos a ver quién tiene cara de que se acuerda. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Todos me ven así como yo, teacher. Very nice. <laughs> oh, that is like, no, all right, very good. A ver, Mariano, fíjese que usted tiene carita de que se acuerda. <laughs> a ver, Mariano, so. When we have a short adjective, one syllable adjective, and we want to compare, what do we do, Mariano? Adding in the end the, the ed. Ed or er? Er. Ah, ER. All right. So we have one syllable adjective and we add ER, right? Yeah. Ah, okay. Very good. Now, a ver. Aha. Uh -huh. Domingo. When we have a long adjective, what do we do to the verb? To the verb. To the adjective. I'm sorry. <laughs> what do we do to the adjective, Domingo? Cuando es un adjetivo uh -huh. largo y lo queremos comparar. Es more. Ajá, more. more. Y el more, more, Domingo, lo ponemos before or after the adjective. Lo lamento mucho. Mm. Lamento que no voy a estar con ustedes más adelante. Y lo estuve considerando, pero... Eh, Car no perdón, Carlita, si gusta su todo micrófono. Todo. Carlita, nos ayuda con su micrófono. Thank you, ok. All right, all right. So, y todo así como que pasó. Es que está tenso, tenso. Sí, sí, cabal, es como que pasó. Pero ¿por qué lo lamenta? Te vamos con la intriga, tú. Ya me hicieron reír. Oh my goodness, está bien, Carlita, no se preocupe. That happens. All right, Domingo, perdóneme, yo sé que usted me estaba explicando. All right, entonces decimos, ponemos el more before or after the adjective, Domingo. Hasta de adjetivo. Seguro Domingo, como se, como no. que se llama Domingo Alexander González. No, es por es uh, antes. Before. 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 Yes, before. Domingo. Very nice. Okay. 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 Very good. Let's see. Ever. Okay. So, su compañero Mariano and Domingo ya nos explicaron qué hacemos con los adjetivos comparativos. A unos we add er and another ones we add more. 
pero que siempre le tenemos que poner ever. What do we always have to add to the adjective? Always, always, always. The comparative adjective. Next to the adjective. Uh -huh. Done. Done. Ah, very good. Now, ever, can you give me an example using a long adjective and make a sentence, any sentence? Any sentence, whatever. Whatever sentence any you want. Okay. The, the cars, the cars are small, clean and no, clean. Clean or clean? No, it's clean is cleaner, but that's not mm -hmm. clean. See, 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 clean is cleaner. <laughs> okay, the car is more uh, faster, is rapid. <laughs> see, faster también, no. Uh -huh. No, somebody help me. Okay, yo creo que Doris le quiere ayudar. Ella está así que quiere participar desde que entró a clase. Antes que continuemos, eh, uh -huh. yo tenía una duda con referente a esta estructura. Sí, sí. De utilizar el mod, el adjective, y que siempre tiene que llevar el DAM. Sí, sí. Yo tuve eh, un inconveniente en, en la, la plataforma, plataforma con, ajá, con referente a, a la tarea. Uh -huh. No me equivoco, era la segunda y la tercera. Sí, igual. En la cual, en la cual no, este, no, cuando no, la poníamos correcta, toda la estructura con DAM, no se lo agarraba. Eh, no lo agarraba, pero eh, por ahí vi que habían compartido de que quitándole el DAM, Ajá. si la daba correcta. Sí. No sé, en todos los casos, ¿ves? ¿eh? Sí, o, lo que pasa o, es que... O... Sí, Ever, ahí había un error de dedo. Cuando se hizo la plataforma, omit... no es que omitieron, es que ya lo habían... O sea, no... No lo habían puesto como opción, pero tendría que siempre, 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 ver como que usted se llama Ever de Jesús Candrae Montano, siempre cuando comparamos vamos a llevar el DAN. Right? Entonces, okay. de hecho, eso hay que arreglarlo, ¿verdad? Entonces ya se reportó para que lo puedan arreglar, para que ustedes no tengan esa confusión, ¿verdad? A veces, a veces sí o a veces no, es siempre. Siempre que sea un adjetivo okay. comparativo va a llevar el DAN. Right? Yes. Entonces, ese es un error de dedo. ¿Verdad? Grave, pero hay que arreglarlo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, very good. Ok, hoy sí, Doris. A ver, tell me your sentence, okay. Doris. Uno largo uh, quiero, Doris. Um, ok, let me see. Uh, my, my dog is crazier, is crazier than my cat because he, is, he doesn't normal. <laughs> because he's not normal? <laughs> no. Okay. All right, now. It's okay, the sentence is fine, Doris, but crazier is not a long adjective. I want an adjective where you have yes. to use more. Can you think of another sentence? Oh. Obviamente le estoy diciendo a Doris, pero todos están pensando, ¿verdad? All right, okay. Vamos a ver. En lo que piensa, vamos con Vane. A ver, Vane, tell me another sentence using a long adjective. So you can use more. I prefer to visit el lago de Coatepeque. Ya no. You prefer visit? I prefer to visit lago, lago de Coatepeque because it's O el lago de Ilopango, oh. mejor, más bonito que de Ilo, que ah, te peque. Algo así quería ponerlo. Ajá, es, pero ¿cómo lo es, va a comparar? Con un adjetivo largo. Hmm, a ver, en lo que piensa Vane. Roberto, a ver, Roberto. Tell Ajá. me a sentence. I want you to use more. Va a ser una oración comparando dos cosas o dos personas, pero el adjetivo debe llevar el more porque es un adjetivo largo. Uh -huh. Ok. I think... 
I think a rest in, in a bed is more comfortable than a, a sofa. Yes, very good, Roberto. <laughs> it is very good, super, very well done. Yes. Thank you, Roberto. Yeah, yeah. okay. Excellent, yes. Roberto, very good. Aha, uh -huh, Bonnie, tell me your sentence. I prefer to visit the Lago de Cuartepeque because it's more wonderful than Lago de Gopan. Excellent, Bonnie. Yeah, very nice. Okay, aha, uh -huh, Doris, ya, yeah? lista? Y después va Johnny. Yes, and uh, let me think. Um, I like to go to the beach uh, because it's more beautiful than the mountain. Excellent. Yes, very good, Doris. Very good. Okay, ya ves, estamos calentando motores, right? Very good. Let's see. Aha, uh -huh, Johnny. Uh, beans are more delicious than <laughs> rice. <laughs> Yes, they are. Very good. Okay, very good. Let's see. Gabi, luego va Daniel. Aha, uh -huh, Gabi, and then Daniel. Buy an iPhone is more expensive than buy a Samsung. <laughs> okay, to buy. To buy an iPhone is more expensive. Yes, very good. Thank you, Gabi. Very good. Daniel Antonio, tell us your sentence, please. Okay. Um... La Puerta del Diablo is more famous than Lago de Cuatepeque. I don't know. <laughs> okay. All right. Very good. Okay. Nice. Thank you. Okay. Very good, guys. Do you have any questions about the adjectives? Comparative adjectives. ¿Nos queda claro si es de una sílaba le agregamos ER? Si es de dos o más le agregamos MORE? Hay obviamente algunos adjetivos que tienen dos sílabas, pero solo se le agrega el ER. Ahora right, tenemos que como ir entendiendo cuáles son cuál, pero todos siempre, all right, quitando el error que está en la plataforma, siempre le tenemos que poner ¿qué? Al final, dan, always, si no, no comparamos, ¿ok? All right, ahora les voy a decir una oración. Yo les voy a decir, um, I don't know, uh, this house is more cleaner than the apartment. ¿Está bien dicha esa oración? Yes, no? No, teacher. No, no why not? You, you, you are too cleaner and only you, cleaner. Don't, Yes, only cleaner and you use more. 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 Excellent, more. right? We don't use, no, no, no le ponemos las dos cosas, sino es como que estamos recontra comparando. <laughs> All right, so we can do that. Okay, very good. So that was the end of the class yesterday. Casi al final de la clase de ayer estábamos viendo conjunctions. All right, y ahí quiero que nos quedemos en lo que tomó la primera asistencia. Así es que vayan repasando ahí, si las apuntaron por ahí, igual están en su manual. All right, veamos entonces. Um, give me a second. All right, let me see. We have Adela Trinidad. Gracias. con suegra. Thank you. All right, Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gómez. Present teacher. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present teacher. Debbie Jasmine Girón Ramírez. Teacher, aquí estoy, solo que... ¿Sí? Tengo la cámara volteada, por eso no la pongo. <risa> ok, no se preocupe. Estoy cargando, estoy cargando mi tabla. Ah, ok, that's ok. Domingo Alexander González. Present. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present teacher. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present teacher. Thank you. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Present. Carla Benacir Lara González. Present. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Present. 
Linda Stephanie Ramirez Abrego. All right, permítame. A ver, um, Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Present teacher. Thank you. María Gabriela Batres Mármol. Present. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Present teacher. Vanessa Noemi Reyes Lemus. Present. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Okay. A ver, Bismar Ulises Martínez Ortiz. No. Okay. Uh, we have Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Present. Julio Cesar Vega Aguilar. Present. Okay. Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodríguez. Present. Victoria Maria Vázquez Juárez. Present. Okay. And Joana Beatriz Orellana Acevedo. Present. Thank you. Excellent. Very nice. Thank you for being in class, guys. All right. So, as I was telling you before I took the attendance, yesterday we were talking about conjunctions. All right. Y esas conjunctions se le llamaban como? What is the name of these conjunctions? Fun boys. Yes. Fun boys. Fun boys. Yes. Estas fun boys pertenecen a qué tipo de conjunctions? ¿Se acuerdan? Conjunction. Ajá, esos conjunctions se llaman como. Coordination. Coordination. ¿Mm? Ah, coordinating conjunctions. Coordinating conjunctions. Okay. All right, yes. Okay. Now, these coordinating conjunctions lo que hacen es unir. All right. ¿Y qué unen? What do they um join, guys? Do you remember what they join? Sentences. Yes, sentences. What else? Uh -huh. What else do they join? Word. Words, yes. Palabra. Okay. Yes, also ideas. Okay, very good. So I'm going to share this with you. I'm going to share this with you. Okay, so here we have the fun boys. Okay, and I, um, we say coordinating conjunctions. Now, we have for, and, nor, but, or, yet, and so. Y nos quedábamos ayer haciendo oraciones con ellas. All right, vemos aquí que decimos for explains reasons or purpose. All right, you study English for, um, I don't know, for your professional growth. All right, and you say, well, I study or I work in the morning and in the afternoon. All right, so you have different uh, coordinating conjunctions and we use them differently. Okay, ahora, sin más que explicar ahorita, por ahorita obviamente, nos vamos a ir a esto. All right, now, here we have, hold on, I just want to see something here. All right, here we have, this is add the corresponding punctuation to the sentences below. Check answers with a classmate. A ver, solo leamos la ahorita. Um, Carla, can you read number one, Carlita? Ya voy, denme un segundito. Um, let me see. Manuel, can you read number two? And uh, Trini, can you read number three? Ahorita solo leámosla. Okay, um, number one. I go to expensive. I go to expensive restaurants for their service. And dishes are very good. Okay, very good. Thank you. Who's reading number two? Number two. Restaurants need to offer specialty dishes and they have to offer take out in case you are in a hurry. Excellent. All right. A specialty dishes. Very good. And who's reading number three? The delivery person arrived late, so we got the food for free. Ah, all right. Okay. So here it says, I go to expensive restaurants for their service and dishes are very good. 
All right, that's a weird sentence. All right, now in here, where do you have the punctuation? And then this, uh, de acuerdo a lo que está arriba, a donde pondríamos la coma? Before, after restaurants. Mm, I go to expensive restaurants, coma, for their service and dishes are very good. Yes? yes. Okay. Yes. All right. Everybody agrees with that? Uh, yes. Service and yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All right. Because, also have uh -huh, Johnny? Coma, coma, bah, I, don't, I don't know. Before fun boys. Uh huh. No. <laughs> In this case, it would be four, right? All yes. right. Now, the, but the yeah, roof. but we also have and their service and dishes are very good. All right. So according to this, we would have to add another um comma to that sentence. All right. So in that mm -hmm. case, we would have to have two. two. Number two, restaurants need to offer specialty dishes and they have to offer takeout in case you are in a hurry. Where do you have to add the comma? After dishes. After dishes. Yes. All right. Then we have the delivery person arrived late, so we got the food for free. Oh, nice. <laughs> Where's the comma? After before late. so. Place. After late or before so. All right. Very good. Okay. So that's where we have to use the punctuation. All right. So let's see. This is what I'm going to do right now. Sin más, ya, nos, ya vamos a regresar a explicar la, algunas que nos cuestan un poquito más de los fanboys. Pero right now what I want you to do is this. We're going to work on number nine. Solo les leo las instrucciones y ya les explico bien. It says, write a 10 line review of your favorite restaurant. What services do they offer? What characteristics make this restaurant good? Use comparative adjectives and coordinating conjunctions. All right, entonces vamos a mezclar un poquito de los comparative adjectives y un poquito de los fun boys or um, coordinating conjunctions que sabemos usar, voy a decirlo así. All right, pero de qué restaurante? Yo le voy a asignar un restaurante, ¿ok? Juntos en su grupo, you're going to write a review. All right, you know what a review is? Es como que usted dice, sí, eh, X restaurante is very good because, bla, 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 usted me da razones, contestando esas preguntas que están ahí. En el sentido de, what services do they offer? Usted me puede decir, ah, mire, por decir algo, um, la carnita es mamachus. <laughs> All right. So they, what is, they have, do they have delivery? Creo que no. I think they have takeout and they have dine-in, but they don't have um, delivery service, all right? Entonces, contestando estas preguntas o guiándonos por estas preguntas nos van a servir para escribir a 10-line review of your favorite restaurant. So look, in este caso, I will give you the restaurant. Si usted no lo conoce, all right, that's okay. Tal vez alguien de su grupo lo conoce y ahí hacemos juntos el escrito. Si están trabajando en computadora, necesito que lo escriban, lo digiten para poder venir y compartirlo cuando lo podamos ya eh, socializar. All right, a ver, I'm going to make the groups ahorita y antes de que se vayan les voy a asignar el restaurante. Hold on. Seven, seven groups. All right. Voy a crearlos ahorita y les voy a decir. A ver, sala uno. Ahí está Domingo, Johnny, and Leticia. All right. You guys are working on, van a hacer el review de McDonald's. All right. Sala dos, Trini, Doris, and Mariano. You are making a review of Tony Romas. All right. Number three, Debbie, Carlita, and Roberto, you are making a review on, um, ay, ya me dio hambre. <laughs> you are making a review on Carnitas Mama Chus. Yes. You know Carnitas Mama Chus? Yes. Yeah. Okay, sala, sala tres, Debbie, Carlita, and Roberto. Yes, right? 
Excellent. All right. Sala 4, Carlos, Ever, and Joanna, you are making a review on Pollo Campero. Number five, Daniel, Manuel, and Walter, you are making a review on. Oh my goodness. Hmm. No sé. <laughs> ¿Ah? Buffalo wings. Ah, buffalo wings. Okay. All right. Sounds good. All right. Jorge, Vane, and Victoria, you are making a review on um, Subway. All right. Claudia, Julio, bueno, no, Julio está de oyente. And Gaby, you guys, you girls, Claudita and Gaby, you're making a review on Papa Jones. Okay? Yes? Okay, so, ocho y media, un cuarto, en 15 minutos, espero que hayan terminado ese review, acuérdense de incluir comparative adjectives y algunas de las uh, conjunctions de los fun boys que ustedes más manejen, ¿ok? Yes? Traten de digitarlo para poderlo compartir cuando regresemos.
Hi, Linda. Hi, teacher. Hey, Linda. Sorry. No, no Tuve problemas con la laptop. Ah, ok, no se preocupe. Ahorita sus compañeros están haciendo una tarea, eh, un párrafo. La voy a mandar a un grupo para que esté ahí atenta y si puede participar con ella, súper bien. Oye. Ok, de acuerdo, gracias.
Hi, girls. And Roberto, you finished? Almost, I think. Almost finished. Almost. Okay, that's okay. Le, a Roberto le pasó algo porque se desconectó. Ah, okay. So Luis Alfredo tocó con Carlita. Sí, pero él se acaba de desconectar, lo acabo de ver. Y se le había como trabado, creo yo, porque ya no nos respondió. Ok, all right. Les voy a dar igual un, unos cuatro minutitos más. Ok, teacher. Thanks. Thank you. Okay. Hi, Emily, ah, Joana, Carlito, you finished? No, I, teacher. Yes. No, teacher. <laughs> nos faltan dos líneas. Ok, that's ok. Ok. <laughs> Repitiendo entonces, Pollo Campestre offers Hello. de agua. Hi, Doris, Mariano, and Trini, finished? Sí, sí. Ah, yes, teacher, pero estamos escribiendo en el teclado. For ladies. <laughs> For ladies everybody. Okay. No se preocupen. Tenemos tiempo todavía. Um, bye. Every, every okay. Friday. Every Friday. Every Friday. Every Friday. Every Friday. Every Friday. Uh -huh. Okay. Hacer, okay. Hi, Johnny. Hi, Leticia. And Domingo. Le habilité la pantalla, Johnny. Yes. <laughs> Hay hacer falta la teacher ya después. <laughs> McDonald's versus Wendy's. Oh no. Yes. Pero a mí los dos me gustan. <laughs> a mí también. Uh, but, uh, in Wendy's, it doesn't sell ice cream. Or no. Only, fro only Frosties, or no sé qué se llama. Mm -hmm. And coffee? I don't know. I don't drink coffee, Johnny, so I don't know. <laughs> no, Wendy's no coffee. No. no coffee. They don't drink I mean, they don't sell coffee. I did. Right. Uh, in, in McDonald's, is is the happy day of children. Yeah. Ah, the happy meal. The happy meal. Uh-huh. And mm -hmm. in, in Wendy's, uh, does, doesn't... No, he no. doesn't have... Happy meal. Uh -huh. No, all right. Okay, very good. Todavía les falta un poquito, ¿verdad? Yes. Yes. All right. Okay. But um, yeah, Ma Johnny, make sure that you write a paragraph with that information, right, Johnny? Yes. Okay. All right. Not not sentences, like a paragraph. Yes. This is an idea. Okay. For the paragraph. Okay, perfect. Yes. Okay. Okay, let's just seguir trabajando. Leti está por ahí, no. Yes, bye. Ah, okay, Leti. Yeah, that's okay. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Hi, Daniel, Walter, and Manuel. Hello, teacher. Hi, teacher. Yes. Hi. You can you can see the chat. Sure, you can show me. Uh, I try to. How I can project. Um, vaya hacia abajo donde dice compartir pantalla. Ah, comparto la pantalla. Sí, se sí puede. Solo de mí un segundito, permítame. Right. All right, let's see. Reviewable one restaurant, Buffalo Wings. Buffalo Wings is a restaurant with delivery service and book table. Uh -huh. They are, ah, they are specialty in chicken food and is more delicious than Campero restaurant. They have many types of hot sauces. The chipotle sauce is more spicy. Mm. The 9-11 sauces. But Buffalo Wings restaurant is only stay in the capital city 
and is in stay in another department of the country. So the restaurant is it's the only principal mall of San Salvador and La Libertad. The waiters are polite and faster, and the food has a good quality. Okay, all right. A ver. Se los corrijo ahorita. Por favor. Ahorita voy, permítame. Solo asigno a Roberto que se salió, tuvo problema de red. Oh, así, por favor. Ya voy, ya voy, ya voy. All right, okay, veamos entonces. Y dice, Buffalo Wings is a restaurant with delivery service and a book, and book table. Okay, they, their specialty is chicken food. They are de ellos, ¿verdad? Their specialty is chicken food. Yes, we can say ellos dicen en comida, comida de pollo. Como dice Walter, perdón. Eh, ellos están especializados en comidas. Ah, entonces decimos, de they are specialized in chicken food. Ya no decimos specialty. Es, specialized. Con I latina. Y luego Z y D. Z y D. Uh -huh. Specialized. They are E D. They are I E D. I E D. No, a special. Listen. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. They are specialized in chicken food, and is more delicious than Campero restaurant. They have many types of hot sauces. The chipotle sauce is more spicy. A ver, spicy es de dos sílabas y es spicier. All right, no le ponemos more. So it's spicier than 9-11 uh, sauces. But Buffalo Wings restaurant, it's only in the capital city. Mm -hmm. It's only in the capital city. Or you say Buffalo Wings can be found only in the capital city. And it isn't in another, it isn't, quítale el estate. And it isn't in another department, okay, of the country. So the restaurant is only on main malls. It's only on main malls. Main. Como main street. M-A-I-N, main. Como principal, but we don't say principal malls, we say main malls. Mm -hmm. Of San Salvador and Libertad. The waiters are polite. ¿Con qué lo está comparando? ¿Con qué lo están comparando cuando dice the waiters? On, are, no, no, no les están comparando. Okay. Que son amables. The waiters are yeah. polite, pero luego faster si lo están comparando con algo. No, the, the only say is the waiter is polite and faster is is only say is the the waiters is the the server is uh -huh. so is, okay is I, okay okay so delete faster and just leave it as fast the waiters uh -huh. are polite and fast uh huh and the food has good quality conté fast conté fast and the ah, food has en el equipo del fast uh -huh. and the food has has a good quality all right okay mm -hmm. all right perfect en nuestra nota 5 <laughs> <laughs> no, of course not, Walter. It's very good. Oh, it's good. It's good. Okay. Excellent. Very good. Okay. Yo creo que ya la mayoría de grupos va terminando. All right. So, le, eh, voy a revisar solo un grupito más y ya los empiezo a sacar. Okay? Thank you. Thank you.
for that. Hi, for Carlitos, you wanna visit. never finished? Yeah, teacher, finish. Yes, teacher. We get some media about it. Oh, all right, okay. I think, I think. Yes, thank you, teacher. Ok, all right. Entonces, vamos a salirnos ya. Los voy a sacar a todos y empezamos a compartir. ¿Lo hicieron en, en compu para poderlo ver? No. No, teacher. No. no. En, en arameo. <risa> Pero usted me lo, me lo lee. Ustedes me lo van a leer. Así que no hay problema. Igual lo corrijo. Ok. Ok. Thank you. Ya. Okie dokie, guys. Let's check. All right. Vamos a ver. Okay. So everybody's back with me right now. Let's work on Sala 1. Domingo, Johnny, and Leticia. All right. Can you guys share your screen so we can see what you wrote, please? Thank you, Johnny. All right, okay, McDonald's versus Wendy's. All right, let's see. Mm, who's gonna read? Quien lo va a leer? Excuse me. I don't know. Okay, or, or, Domingo. Domingo, okay. Uh, McDonald's versus Wendy's. Mm -hmm. The hamburgers of McDonald's are bigger than that Wendy's. But the meat are more delicious than McDonald's hamburgers. <laughs> McDonald's and Wendy's have delivery service. Mm -hmm. So the two restaurants are similar. And McDonald's sells ice cream. Other tea, other tea is that McDonald's has a beautiful environment. 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 Uh -huh. environment. environment. Yes. Environment, but when this has I too. Has it too. All right. Uh -huh. Okay. Vamos a say the hamburgers of McDonald's are bigger than Wendy's, but the meat is more delicious is more delicious than McDonald's hamburgers. McDonald's and Wendy's have delivered service, so the two restaurants are similar, and McDonald's sells ice cream. Ah, piensa que ahí yo le cambiara la conjunction de and a but. Porque si me están diciendo que uno vende, pero el otro no, o So I think I would change it to but, but McDonald's sells ice cream. Other thing is that McDonald's has a beautiful environment. A ver, igual ahí. Other thing is that McDonald's has a beautiful environment. Y están diciendo que también Wendy, ¿cierto? Yes or no? Yes, yes. Okay. yes. Okay, so other thing that is that McDonald's has a beautiful environment. Uh, Cámbiale a so das Wendy's. Y ahí estamos usando la, la conjunction so. Y estamos diciendo que también el Wendy's tiene un, un ambiente así como nice. So das Wendy's. So das 
El auxiliar, ajá. So does Wendy's. Hasta ahí. Y te le hace too. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, that's better. Thank you, guys. Very good. Super, thank you. All right. Igual, acuérdense que la idea de presentar sus um, párrafos en este caso es para que todos los podamos ver y aprendamos, ¿verdad? De todos un poco. All right, a ver. Um, sala 2, Trini, Doris, and Mariano. Ok. Ah, Tony Ramos. Who's reading it, guys? Um, me. Okay. Okay. Tony Romans. Tony Romans has more delicious ribs than buffalo wings, and they have good service. Also, you can take out the food. Tony Romans offer happy hour for ladies every Friday. They have a better customer service than Bennigan's, but they don't have book a table nor delivery. The place is cleaner than Pizza Hut and the environment <laughs> is comfortable. His specialty <laughs> is barbecue shorty ribs. Oh my goodness. So in other words, Tony Romas is the best restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Very good. Nice. I like it. Déjelo ahí. Ahorita lo vemos. Tony Romas has more delicious ribs than buffalo wings. And they have good service. Also, you can take... Okay. Also, you can... Hmm. Ajá. Also, you cambiémosle un poquito ahí. Also, you have you can have takeout service en lugar de take out the food, porque así se entiende. O sea, sí se entiende lo mismo, pero cuando dice uh -huh. take out the food es como que usted la agarró. De hecho, eso lo hace, pero el uh -huh. take out es el servicio que ofrecen. Ya no uh -huh. necesitamos the food. Also, okay. so also, also, also you can take out. Uh -huh. Also, you can take out. Ya yeah, no, the food, porque ya sabemos que es the food. Oh, okay, ah, okay, okay. okay. Tony, oops, Tony Romas offers. All right, con offers. ese. Offers happy hour. Oh, oh, happy hour for ladies. Y como saben, every <laughs> <laughs> They have. <laughs> Coincidencia, dice. They mm -hmm. have a better customer service than Benny, Benny Gans, but they do not have book a table nor delivery. Ah, the place is cleaner than Pizza Hut and the environment is comfortable. Ahí no lo están comparando, solo están diciendo no, que... Uh, no, sí. Um, en lugar de his, decimos it's a specialty, porque es un restaurante. It's okay. a specialty. Mm -hmm. No, eh, el posesivo, it's, it's uh -huh, sin apóstrofe, así, exacto. It's a specialty is barbecue shorty ribs. Very good, thank you, nice. Okay. All right, thank you. All right, vamos a leer uno más y toma, toma asistencia. Si gusta, Doris, are you stop sharing? Ahorita, ahorita, teacher. <laughs> ¿Qué le voy a contar? Esto nunca lo había hecho. Bueno, y ellos, y siempre es la primera vez. Sí, ellos me explicaron. Y hoy, hoy no se puede salir. Hoy, <risa> All right, very good, that's okay. Súper, ya ves, siempre se aprende algo sí, nuevo. A ver, sí. Debbie, Carlita, Ann, Roberto. ¿No? O ya, me, ya lo presenta no, Alberto, creo que lo puede compartir. No, solo que no, yo no, yo tengo mi tablet, así que no sé cómo. Ah, vaya, vale, bien, no se preocupe. Vale. No sé si Carlita o Roberto. Yo, yo lo comparto entonces. Excelente, thank you. Are you using the phone too much? Okay. Excellent. Oh, all right. Very good. ¿Quién lo lee? Who's going to read it? Yo, teacher. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Roberto. <laughs> 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 eh, eh, 
Carnitas mamachus. Yes. Mamachus carnitas offer a good service. Offer a good service. And have a and they have a characteristic flavor. The menu is more interesting than typical Margot, but the price is more expensive. So they have a better time attention because they work until a middle of night. Ah, okay. All right, very good. Veamos entonces. Mamachos Carnitas offer good service offers. ¿Verdad? Mm -hmm. Good service and has. Oh, has, has. And has a and has a characteristic flavor. The menu is more interesting than Ok, cuando tenemos nombres propios no los cambiamos, ¿verdad? Es como los nombres de personas. Si usted se llama Luz, no le voy a decir Light. Usted se va a llamar Luz aquí o en la China. All right? okay. Entonces, nombres propios no los cambiamos nunca. The typical okay. Margot, very good. But the price is more expensive. Oh, ok. So, they have better time, mm, como mejor horas de atención. Eso me quisieron poner. De servicio, horas. Sí. Ok. Sí, que trabajan. Ajá. So they have better. That's ok. Better time attention because they work until midnight. Ok, that's fine. All right. Yes. Thank you. Nice. Thank you, Roberto, for sharing. Y por hacerlo grande, porque yo no leí al principio. <risa> All right, very good. Ok, tomamos la segunda asistencia y luego seguimos con Carlos, Ever and Joana. Let's see. Uh, vamos a ver aquí. A ver, we have Adela Trinidad González Consuelo, Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Presente. Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gómez. Thank you. Daniel Antonio Luna. No, Debbie Jasmine Girón Ramírez. Present teacher. Domingo Alexander González. Present teacher. Ever de Jesús Candrae Montano. Present teacher. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Present. Carla Benacir Lara González. Present. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Present. Linda Stephanie Ramírez Abrego. Present. Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Ok, María Gabriela Batres Mármol. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Present. Vanessa Noemi Reyes Lemos. Present. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Bismar Ulises Martínez Ortiz. Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Julio, thank you. Julio César Vega Aguilar. Present. Doris, thank you, Julio. Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodríguez. Present. Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. Present. And Joana Beatriz Orellana Acevedo. Present. Thank you. All right. Okay, let's continue. Carlitos, Ever, and Joana. Pueden compartir o no? Todos me lo van a decir. Yes, teacher. Ahorita okay. voy a ver si comparto. Excelente, thank you. Can you see? Yes. Oh, wow. Yes, I can see. Nice. Okay. <laughs> I like it. Voy a camper offer better delivery service than takeout because rarely offer the takeout service. Voy a camper to national level is more famous than for your campus. <laughs> But Kentucky offer drink really refill if you want a hamburger and fries. So for your computer, you smell them better. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I like that logo. 
Very nice. And thumbs down. Oh, no. Okay, very good. So, Pollo Campero offers better delivery service than takeout because, okay, because they rarely offer, because they rarely offer the takeout service. Okay. Pollo Campero is, is to national level. Ah, espérame, 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 espérame. Pollo Campero to national level. No, así déjelo. Pollo Campero to national level is more famous than Pollo Campestre, but KFC offers drink refill if you buy a hamburger and fries. So, Pollo Campero is not... Okay, okay. So, Pollo Campero is not better than... Than quién? So, pollo campero, podríamos decir, so pollo campero no, think, is not I better think, than the others? The, the others. No, la idea era que se nos trajeron unas carretas ahí y queríamos decir que el pollo <laughs> campero no es tan bueno. Uh -huh. ¿Querían decir pollo campero qué? No es tan bueno. Pollo campero no, no ah, es tan bueno. Ah, so pollo campero is not as good, entonces. No es tan bueno. Ah, ok. Is not as, it's not know. as good. Ajá. Uh -huh. AS is not as good. <laughs> ok, teacher, después lo arreglo. Sí, no, no se preocupe, está súper bien. Excellent, thank you. Yes, very nice, very creative. All right, seguimos entonces, thank you, with Sala 5. Daniel, Manuel, and Walter. Ah, ya se los revisé, ¿verdad? Ustedes se los revisé. Igual, si gustan, compártanlo para que los demás compañeros lo vean. Después de ellos, we go with Jorge, Vane, and Victoria. Excellent, thank you. Okay, Buffalo Wings is a restaurant with delivery service and book table. They are specialized in chicken food and is more delicious than Campero restaurant. Por el pollo Campero y se ha sufrido. They have um, many types of hot sauces. The chipotle sauce is spicier than 9-11 sauces. But Buffalo Wings restaurant is only in the capital city. And it isn't in another department of the country. So the restaurant is only, is only, ahí me faltó. So the restaurant is on, only on main malls. Uh -huh. Of San Salvador and La Libertad. The waiters are polite and fast and the food has a good quality. Yes, super. Nice, guys. Thank you. Yes. All right. Thank you. All right. Next group. I think it was group number six. Jorge, Vane, and Victoria. Can you share screen? No sé si ya la observa, Tichi. Sí, sí, ahorita, sí, claro. All right, ¿qué me la lee? And yo. All right. Subway is a restaurant that offers different types or sandwich tips. No, what types or sandwich? Mm -hmm. This restaurant is faster than others because all ingredients are ready to use. Subway has a promotion that you can have and card to accumulate points and you change it in other time. The sandwich are more delicious <laughs> than Campero's sandwich because you can eat a breakfast, lunch of, or dinner. dinner. Dinner, yeah. Hoy de verdad que estamos, pobrecito el pollo, ahora ha sufrido. <laughs> ¿Qué right. hizo pollo campero? ¿Qué I hizo? know, eh? <laughs> All right. Subway is a restaurant that offers different types of... Off sandwiches? Creo que se le fue error de dedo ahí en lugar de or, debería de ser off. Off sandwiches. Yes, yes, sir. Off. Okay. Mm -hmm. This restaurant is faster than others because all ingredients are ready to use. Subways, okay, ahí pluralizaron subways, entonces en ese caso pongámosle have, 
All right, Subways have a promotion that you can have a card. Quitele la N a an. All right, a card to accumulate points and you change them. And you change them. Porque son varios puntos, ¿verdad? And you change them in other time. All right. The sandwiches are more delicious than campero sandwiches because you can eat them. Como estamos hablando de sandwiches y lo están pluralizando, pongámosle them en lugar de, en lugar de it. Campero sandwiches because you can... Can, ah, solo que... Uh, you can eat them at breakfast, lunch, or dinner. Okay. I you can change. Okay. Yeah. Abajo también, en lugar de poner, because you can eat at breakfast, you can eat them at breakfast. Okay, teacher. Very good. Thank you. Nice. Thank you. Excellent. Let's see. And the last group, but not least, Claudita, Linda, and Maria, Gabriela, and Gabi. Are you sharing a screen, Gabi? No. Yes. Okay. Oh, nice doggy. <laughs> Papa Jones. All right. Ahí sí léamelo porque ya no veo. Who can read it? Perdón, olvidé activar la, el, el octavo. Okay. Ahorita. Papa John's is better restaurant than Pizza Hut because they have more ingredients and drinks. But Pizza Hut has bigger restaurants and is more popular than Papa John's. Papa John's neither allow drink alcohol nor smoke inside their restaurants. Also, you can pay your food by credit card or cash. Papa John's always prepares your food with fresh ingredients, so you have to wait for it. Oh. Wow, I like it. Hold on, let me just read it. Ay! <laughs> Papa John's is a better restaurant than Pizza Hut because they have more ingredients and drinks. I have a Pizza Hut has bigger restaurants and is more popular than Papa John's. Papa John's neither allows. Uh, Papa John's neither allows, con ese. Alco uh -huh. alcohol, alcoholic drinks, de la vuelta. Okay. Um, no smoke inside the restaurant. Also, you can pay your food by credit card or cash. Papa Jones always prepares your food with fresh ingredients, so you have to wait for it. Very good. I like it. Thank you. Okay. Yes. Nice. <laughs> All right. Perfect, guys. Very good. Thank you. It was very well done, Javen. Very nice. You guys are doing great here. Okay. Okay, just give me a second. Okay. All right, guys, let's continue here with your book. We're going to use your book right now. Okay, so let's go to the next page. We have this one. All right, so it's on page um, 12. All right, says so the restaurant industry. I will be able to, Walter, can you please read where it says I will be able to? I will be able to organize a face restaurant menu that features appetizers, snap, main cures, desserts, and drinks options. Excellent, thank you, Walter. All right, so I will be able to organize all right sorry i will be able to organize a basic restaurant menu that features appetizers snacks main course desserts and drinks options all right number one let me see um let's start debbie can you read number one what is
Let's start. What is your favorite study? Have you ever eat, eaten at, eaten at an all you can eat restaurant? What was the menu like? Excellent, thank you. Ya vamos a regresar a esas preguntas, but right now we are going to read the conversation. All right, so just give me a second so we can read it together here. All right, so here we have read the conversation about popular menu items. Nancy and Jennifer, how well are the new menu items doing? The main fish and chip cor chips courses are doing great. 99% of people like them. Then, the new lemon cake line is not doing very well. Only 35% of our customers liked it. Let me check the online polls for recent products. Yes, just like you said, it seems the new nacho snacks are doing great. 80% of customers liked them. Probably we only have to revise the lemon cake since not many people reacted well. All right, that is the conversation here. A ver. Um, Victoria, can you please be Nancy? Ever, can you please be Jennifer? How well are the new menu items going? The, the main fish and chef curves are doing great. 99% of people like them. Then the new lemon cake line is not going very well. Only 35% of our customers like it. Let me check the online voice for recent products. Yes, yes, who's like you say, uh, it seems the new nacho snacks are doing great um, making of customers like team. Probably. We only have to revise the lemon cake signs. Not many people react to well. All right, thank you. Okay, let me see here. I need two more volunteers. I need a Nancy and I need a Jennifer. Yo, teacher. Thank Jennifer. you. All right, yo, las dos compañeras que dijeron yo, teacher, primero, una es Nancy y la otra es Jennifer. Okay, aquí no, me, no logré fijar. Oh, well, I did. How well are the new menu? Oh, how well are the new menu items doing? The main fish and chips courses are doing great. Ninety-nine percent of people like them. Then the new lemon cake line is not doing very well. Only thirty-five percent of our customers like it. Let me check the online polls for preset products. Yes, just like you said, it's seen the new nacho snacks are doing great. 18% of customers like them. Probably we only have to revise the lemon cake since not many people reacted well. Excellent, thank you. All right. Um, vamos a leerlo one more time. Ay, Nancy, Ay, Jennifer, si usted me dice eh, su nombre de una vez, porque no los puedo ver todos al mismo tiempo. So I don't know who tells me. Who's Nancy? Mi teacher, Mariano. Okay, Mariano, thank you. Who's Jennifer? Gaby. Excellent, Doris, very good. Okay, okay. How well are the new menu items doing? Um, well, uh, Dori? Uh, me. Yes, Doris, yes. <laughs> oh, okay. We, we were waiting for you to start, Doris. <laughs> okay. The, the main fish and ships course are doing great. 99% of people like them. Then the new lemon cake line is not doing very well. 
only 35% of, of our customer like it. Let me check the online food for resale products. Yes, just like you say, it seems the new national snacks are doing great. 18% of customers liking them. Probably we only have to re revise the lemon cake since not many people react well. Excellent, thank you. All right, very good. Vamos a, a ver ahí un poco de pronunciación. Solo recordarles, ¿verdad? Eh, en algunos casos. A ver, how well are the, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> the new menu items doing? Okay, the main dish and chip, chips courses are doing great. 99. All right, of people like them. Then the new lemon cake line is not doing very well. Only 35% of our customers liked it. Let me check the online polls for recent products. Yes, just, just like you said. It seems the new nacho snacks are doing great. 80, cuidado con el número 80, no es 18, es 80. 80% of customers like them. Probably we only have to revise the lemon cake since not many people reacted well. All right, check the, the vocabulary, guys. Do we understand all the vocabulary that is on the conversation? Teacher. Yes, Johnny. The past of say is said. not said. No, it's said. Como said. cuando se tiene said. <laughs> Oh, okay. Yes, Thank it's you. said. Yes, very good. Anybody else? No? Todo el vocabulario está super bien? Excuse me? Polls? Ah, polls are encuestas. Ah, oh, okay. Uh -huh. Como esa que está aquí en su libro, aquí mire. Online polls. Okay. Very good. Anybody else? No? Okay. Very good. Snacks. 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 Uh, ¿Dónde está? Okay. Nachos. Nachos. Snacks. Mm -hmm. Acuérdense que un snack es un, un refrigerio, un aperitivo, un, un, una cosita, all right? A nacho snack, something that you munch on. All right? So that's a snack. All right? Let's see. Anything else? Es, co es como las boquitas, teacher. Um... Sí, en este caso puede ser como boquitas. Ahora, un no, snack no. puede ser un refrigerio para un niño, por ejemplo. También, entonces mm -hmm. depende. All right, yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, so this is what we're going to do right now in our groups. Lo voy a hacer un poquito más pequeño. All right. I want you to. Vamos a trabajar. Vamos a irnos de regreso al number one. In groups, we are going to answer these questions. Usted le va a preguntar cada quien, oh, se van a, a preguntar entre todos, mejor dicho, the questions. Number one, what is your favorite starter? Have you ever eaten at an all-you-can-eat restaurant? What was the menu like? All right. En el caso que usted ya haya comido en todo lo que pueda comer restaurante. All right. So you tell your partner, yes, I have eaten. And what was the menu like? ¿Qué, qué había en el menú? All right, de, to, de todo, pero qué era de todo. All right, now, appetizers. Vámonos donde dice we'll be able to appetizers. Do we understand what appetizers are? ¿Entendemos qué es appetizers? Yes, no. Oh. No. <laughs> no. Ah. no appetizers son aperitivos. Aperitivo. Oh. All right, oh. appetizers. All right, snacks. En este contexto parece como lo que dijo Domingo, boquita, ¿verdad? Pero también puede ser como un refrigerio. Main course es el plato principal. Yes, dessert son los postres. Y drinks, ya sabemos que son drinks. All right. A starter is like a appetizer. Yeah, I think it's similar. 
como una entrada. Ajá, como una entrada. Uh -huh. Ok. Ok. All right, very good. Ok, entonces, vamos a irnos a los grupos y vamos a contestar estas que están aquí. Y luego, I want you to work on this exercise. Number three. All right, number three, termina esta es el ejercicio que está aquí. And then you answer this question. Which of the three products has the highest percentage of acceptance? Basado en este online poll that you have here. All right. A ver. And we are going to work en esta igual. Porque la, la uno, esta que está aquí es como bien corta y no todos hemos comido en un restaurante de ese tipo. Tal vez o sea, la mayoría, pero no todos. All right. So maybe you won't take long. Esto no se va a tardar mucho. Y estos ya podríamos ir... Um, putting the right word on the right category. Que sería un starter, que sería un snack, un main course, dessert and drink, basado en lo que está aquí. Entonces vamos a trabajar on page 12, one and three, and page 13, exercise four. Okay? Of your book. Dejo de compartir y los mando a sus grupos. Let's go, guys. Teacher, a mí no me ha salido el mensajito del grupo. Debbie. Yes. <laughs> Debbie, Debbie, Debbie. Ahorita vuelve Debbie. Permítame, solo voy a dejar que se una también Carlos, Eduardo, para ver a dónde. La voy a cambiar para ver si le sale ahora el... el, el... La invitación de hoy. Okay. Mire ahorita. Sí, ahora sí. Ok.
Hi, Walter. Hi, Walter. Hi, teacher. My, inter my internet down. Ah, okay. Ahorita lo mando. Which group were you in, Walter? What? You were working with Daniel and Manuel, no? Group five. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome.
Carlita, did you finish? Yes, teacher. All right, very good. Gabby finished too? Yes, teacher. Excellent, thank you. All right, guys, so we have here number one. What is your favorite starter? Debbie, what's your favorite one? Uh, I, I uh, my favorite starter uh, is a uh, tortilla soup. Okay, all right, very good. What about Ever? What's your favorite starter, uh, Ever? Okay. Ever? My, yes. my favorite starter is the Chinese roll of the Best Imperial. Okay, uh -huh. all right, very good. What about Manuel? What's your favorite starter? Manuel, your microphone. My, my favorite starter is a fruit salad. Oh, okay, very nice. All right, let's see, one more. Um, Roberto, what is your favorite one? What is your favorite starter? My favorite starter is nachos. Okay, nachos, very good. All right, anybody here? Have you guys, someone, have you ever eaten at all you can eat restaurant? Yes. Nobody? Okay. Who said yes? Me. Push me, perdón, es que no lo veo. Roberto. <laughs> ah, Roberto, okay. And what is, um, what was the menu like? Yeah, the menu was all you can eat of tacos. Oh my goodness, Roberto, really? Yes. That's very delicious. <laughs> yes. Okay, very good. And only tacos? Yes, only tacos. And how many did you eat? Uh, only nine. Only tacos. nine? <laughs> All right, yes. that's a lot of tacos. Very good. What? I, I eat only three. <laughs> yeah, I can eat five, actually. <laughs> All right. A ver, si me ayudan con un micrófono que está abierto por ahí. A ver, anybody else that has eaten all you can eat restaurant? No, nobody else. Gabby, which one, Gabby? Uh, I was uh, names Corral, just Corral. It's, it's not in this country. It's another country. Okay, and what did what? But what was the food like? I mean, was it Mexican, Chinese? uh oh, 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 oh well different kind of foods because oh, food sorry because there was uh beef chicken shrimp ah. um, salmon um all the kinds that you desserts that you like like ice cream also brownies um gabby you're making you know, me hungry okay <laughs> okay I'm that sorry. sounds very delicious <laughs> yeah and also soups they have oh. very uh, very good soups. My favorite, my favorite one is the broccoli cheese soup. That's oh. the best soup that I ever eaten. Oh my goodness! Sounds actually <laughs> yes. delicious just by the name. All right, very nice. Thank you, Gabby. <laughs> Perfect. Anybody else? All you can eat restaurant. Daniel, Orleti, Doris, Carlita, Walter, Carlos, Joanna, no, Vicky, Victoria. I I eat little picker. <laughs> you don't eat very much, Daniel. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. But you can eat sorry. <laughs> All right, very good. What was the other question? Let me see here. Oh, then we went to the next page. I think it was page. Hold on. I'm gonna share my book again. Okay, this one right here. 
Uh, look at the graphic and the conversation. Write the percentages next to the products. Compare your answers with the partner. The new lemon cake line, the new nacho snacks, fish and chips main course. All right, denme un segundito, porfa, en lo que, en lo que vemos acá. Just give me a second. All right, sorry guys, I'm sorry. All right, so the new lemon cake line, what's the percentage? 55%. All right, okay, what about the new nacho snacks? 8%. 80% or 18? 80%. 80, yes, percent, 80%. What about fish and chips? Fish and chips main course. 99%. Okay, very good. All right. Okay, let's see. Which of the three products has the highest percentage of acceptance? Fish and chips. Yes, Maybe. fish and chips. With 99%. Yes, with 99%. All right. Now, um, Linda, if you were in this restaurant, do you would you like to try the lemon cake, the nacho snacks, or the fish and chips? Uh, the lemon cake. Yeah, me too. <laughs> All right, mm -hmm. thank you, Linda. Very good. All right, Vane, what about you? Lemon cake, uh, nacho snacks, or fish and chips? I prefer nachos. Nachos. All right, Trini, what mm -hmm. about you? Lemon cake. Lemon cake? Yeah, me too. <laughs> All right, let's go on to this one here. Building vocabulary. Here we have chicken and rice, French onion soup, burger, cheese and tomato sandwich, lemon cake, grilled fish and potatoes, green salad, English tea, pink lemonade, fruit salad, and cream. All right, starters. ¿Qué pusieron down starters, guys? French onion soup and green salad. Oh, okay. What about snacks? Someone else, tell me about snacks. Cheese yes, and tomato sandwich. Yes. Okay. What else? Anything else for snacks? No. No? Okay. Main course. Okay. Kitchen and rice, okay. burgers, and grilled fish and potatoes. Ah, grilled fish and potatoes. De verdad que esta clase ha sido de, de, de hambre. <laughs> All right, my goodness, guys. That's not nice. All right. <laughs> okay. Estos te faltaron los mariscos. Ah, no, esos no me gustan. <laughs> All right, okay. What about desserts? Lemon cake. Fruit salad and cream. Okay. All right. And drinks? English tea and pink lemonade. Pink lemonade, yes. All right. Okay. And beer. Esa no estaba allí. All right. Ahora, vea, concéntrese en los en los categories donde dice starters, snacks, main courses, dessert, drinks. Piense y haga su propia lista. Un starter, un snack, one main course, one dessert, and one drink that you really, really like. ¿Ok? Piénsenlo ahorita en lo que nos queda de clase. Y nos, lo vamos a empezar a compartir en un minutito.
All right, ready? Let's see. What about Mariano? Tell me about your starters, your snacks, your dessert. Uh huh. My favorite is carrot and nachos with chili. Okay. My favorite snack is uh, different seals, mm -hmm. honey and cashew seals. Okay. And then my favorite main course is a pizza. And dessert is a, I don't know, the cheesecake. 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 Yes. Yay. Uh huh. And my favorite drink is coffee. Coffee, ah, okay. Coffee okay, <laughs> very nice, thank you. Let's see, what about um, Jorgito? Jorge, can you tell us about your favorite starter, snack, main course, dessert, and drink? Okay, uh, starter, uh, my favorite is nacho. Okay. Uh, snacks. Uh, favorite, my favorite is shrimp. ¿Cómo se dice? Ah, lo que te dijo que no estaba en menú. Ah, shrimp. Shrimp. Yes, shrimps. Ah, okay. Uh, main course. Um, fish and potatoes. Ah, very good. Okay. Uh, Dessert. Ice cream. Nice. Okay. And drink. No, yeah. no, I see the beer. <laughs> <laughs> and drinks and uh, lemon. 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 Oh, lemonade. Very good. All right. Very nice. Okay, guys. Mañana continuamos con los demás. Voy a tomar la última asistencia de la noche so you guys can go and rest. Okay. Just give me one second. Ok, let's see. Adela Trinidad González con suegra. Present. Carlos Eduardo Melga Rivas. Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gómez. Present. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present, teacher. Debbie Yasmín Girón Ramírez. Present, teacher. Domingo Alexander González. Present. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present teacher. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present teacher. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Present. Carla Benacir Lara González. Present. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Present teacher. All right. Alinda Stephanie Ramírez Abrego. Present teacher. Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Present teacher. María Gabriel Batres Mármol. Present. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Present teacher. Vanessa Noemi Reyes Lemos. Present. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Bismar Ulises Martínez Ortiz. Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Present teacher. Julio César Vega Aguilar. Present teacher. Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodríguez. Present. Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. And Joana Beatriz Orellana Cebet. Present. Excellent, guys. Very good. Thank you so much. Eh, si gustan, voy a cambiar ahorita. Julio, si se me queda un ratitito y los demás nos podemos retirar. All right, continuamos con las tareas. Thank you for being with me tonight. I will see you tomorrow. Bye, good night. Bye. 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 Good night. Claudita, si gusta, se puede desconectar. All right. Okay, Julio, ¿está por ahí, Julio? Sí, aquí estoy. All right, very good, Julio. Um, entonces, eh, igual, si gusta, Julio, mañana temprano, en la medida de lo posible, 
usted comuníquese ahí a la academia, ¿verdad? Y, y les, les, um, les informa, ¿verdad? De su caso. ¿Ok? Sí, lo voy a hacer en la mañana. Uh -huh. Hable con Jimmy, porque él es el que está coordinando los grupos y esas cosas, ¿verdad? Entonces, diría directamente con él. Ok, está bien, le agradezco mucho. Sí, no, a usted, Julio. Eh, pues cualquier cosa, aquí estamos, ¿verdad? Y yo espero que, que todo le salga bien, es de tener mucha fe y, y esperemos que, que todo salga de la mejor manera, Julio. Oye. Sí, en el nombre de Dios. Sí, Julio. Sí, muchas gracias. Bueno, sí, cuídese un montón y aquí estamos para servirle, oye. Bueno, le okay. agradezco. Bueno, Julio, igual usted. Gracias.